Thank you to all who have come out today to celebrate the 15th annual Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Day Convocation. I am honored to have been one of your MCs today, especially considering I'm only a first year. <laughs> I would like to give a big thank you to the Office of Inclusive Living and Learning for providing me this opportunity to speak today. Additionally, this office, ran by Cecil Youngblood, Sarah Coyer, and Daksha Howard, deserves recognition and thanks for planning this event and also for inviting Lieutenant Governor Mandela Barnes to come and speak today. Furthermore, on behalf of this office and Beloit College, we would like to express our gratitude to Mr. Mandela Barnes for coming out today and being here to take time out to say to speak. Of course, we are grateful for Beloit's own community members, BTO, directed by Timothy Rosenthal and Kaylin Vences, for also taking part in today's convocation. And of course, a big thank you to Senator Tammy Baldwin for coming out and speaking today. As we enter the new year and students, as we enter this next semester, I let us use what we have heard and experienced today to assist us in this new beginning to make change happen. Thank you. Just a little bit more. Um, I just want to thank uh, all of you for turning out today and for coming to our um, Reverend Martin Luther King convocation. Uh, special thanks to Tammy for being here. Always a pleasure to see you. Um, Lieutenant Governor Mandela Barnes, an honor and a privilege and uh, really thankful for you making time uh, to be here. Uh, to President Berryman who always does a really good job of introducing people. Uh, and many other things, and he's not kidding, Kayla, I'm serious. You, you may want to go into witness protection. Uh, uh, but uh, also, it's always an honor for me, and that's why I had to get, uh, come up here. Uh, and oh, I can't say enough about Turner. Uh, you are amazing. We're going to sign you to a contract, bruh. <laughs> uh, but it's always great for me, too, uh, as being a part of Beloit College to actually uh, celebrate a couple of our own. Um, I'm always proud of the students that we have serve as our MCs for this. Uh, it's not the easiest thing in the world to do. <laughs> you pulled it off, Ellis. You're good. You're good. And uh, that's a heck of a first year over there, I think. So uh, I'm proud of you both. And so we couldn't let you escape out of here without giving you a little bit of token of our appreciation for your participation and remembrance of this. And like I said, we're honored to have great students here, all you that are here and uh, all you that are planning to come here, especially now. Uh, <laughs> but uh, it's an honor for me to present you two with, with your plaques too for participating and for the work you did today. And I'm just so thankful and, and glad that you're here and that you can make us look so good. So. So again, thank you all for coming. Uh, try to stay warm, it is Wisconsin. Uh, and be safe on your travels. Thank you very much and God bless. <laughs>